Hi guys, it's Joanne. Um, I'm here today to show you a haul that I got from scrapbook.com. And this is the My Mind's Eye Gingham Farm. Look how pretty this is. I saw this on, I think I might've saw it on, uh, somebody posted it on Instagram. And I was just like, oh, I have to have that. And I don't normally, you know, um, splurge like that. And I got the whole darn kit, I think. Everything, they had some planner things that I did not get. But all right, so let's get into it and see what I got. Um, first, I'm just going to show you these two things. Um, when I ordered from scrapbook.com, these were the free gift. And they normally do have something that they give you for free. So I got three clear daubers which is good because I was running out of daubers. And these are your basic your basic size. You get three of those. And it says they're clear stackable. So, and that's um, scrapbook.com brand. And then you get one of these jumbo sponge daubers. Um, I don't have anything like this. All of mine are that same little size. Um, and this is also, I guess, a scrapbook.com brand. So that was pretty cool, huh? Two freebies with this order? Okay. So let's get into the paper first. Um, if you guys know, I love, um, you know, the country style crafting and the papers and all that. And I don't know, I just saw this with the black and the white and I just thought it was really, really cool. So you get in here, you get six sheets of 12 by 12 double sided <clears throat> and a sticker sheet. So let's see, this is Gingham Farm. So here's the front part really pretty black and white floral and it's like a cream color in the background so I don't know if you can see so well with my lighting it's not really white it's more of a cream and uh, maybe this page is named Georgia it doesn't say on this side but down here it says Georgia so let's see but look at the plaid beautiful and then this one it's kind of the same only reversed Right with the dark background and the lighter flowers, and then here will have like a green, a green. Um, I guess you, maybe like a big gingham. Uh, this one's called Hannah. Oh, and then look at these birds. I love my birds. It says birds of a feather, fly, and then this one's called Birdie. And then here's just another. I guess it's like a plaid checkerboard. I don't know what to call it. Oh, look at this one. This one just has a whole bunch of words. There's no place like home, family. This is really nice. Um, love story. Every picture tells a story. And on the back, you just have this striping. And this one's called Molly. So that's really pretty. And look at this one. This one's more flowers. You got some yellows and greens in this one. And then, oh, I like the back. This one's called Savannah. Oh, so it's all like girls' names, like country girls. Um, and then this one, you have a big plaid here. And then on the back, that's pretty simple, but I kind of like that. And this is called Maddie. Okay, so those are the six 12 by 12 sheets that you get. I can't wait to create something with those. And then you also get this um, sticker sheet. So it's 36 stickers. And these are just flat, flat stickers. Um, they're a little bit thicker than your normal sticker. So we have a bunch of different country themed stickers here, some sentiments, some numbers, a tag. Oh, I can't wait to create with this, guys. Okay, so that's the, the paper set. Let's move that out of the way. Um, and then I also got the 12, uh, I'm sorry, the six by six paper pad. And this comes with 24 double-sided cardstock sheets, 24 unique designs. All right, so you're only getting one of each in here. Oh, that's tricky if you really like one and you want to use it a little bit more, right? All right, let's cut this open and see what we got. I'll try and go quick on the paper because I want to get to the, oh, I can't do it, guys. I want to get to the little doodads, the little crafty bits. Okay. So we'll just flip through this real quick. So we just have these are very similar to the 12 by 12s that we just saw. Oh, they are exactly. Oh, we have some wood grain, wood grain with flowers. You guys see all those? And I know I, I'm 
trying to see. I don't, I guess the lighting's okay. It's just, you know, it, they're very, um, you know, they're not bright colors. Oh, look at that with the spoons. I like that. <clears throat> Another sheet of that. Oh, these little houses. I love those. And just some plaids, some stripes, some leaves and flowers. So it's like a country floral kind of thing. Oh, here's some letters. Oh, that's the whole alphabet out. Some more plaids. Oh, they're not unique. Look, we're repeating now. Oh boy. Okay, good. So we have two of every sheet that's in here. 24 sheets of double sided. See, it says 24 unique designs. All right. Well, I'm excited that there's two of everything. Okay. So that's the six by six paper pad. All right. So let's get into the rest of it. So we got some wood. These are called wood pieces. You get 14 of them. Oh, I'll keep it on here so you guys can see. And you have the little, I love these little houses here. And then you got some words, gather family together, the little pig. I haven't seen any chickens yet. I don't know. <laughs> and then some hearts. All right. A coffee cup. Oh, this little wood one that says memories on it. This is really nice. I like this. I cannot wait to um, create a project with that. And then we have some brads. What if it, I think I can keep it in here. Um, so again, you have the house, you have a tag. Well, those are nice. I, let's open this because I haven't seen brads that actually come with um, little like labels and tags attached to them. So, okay. Yeah. So here's all your brads and all right. So yeah, these are really nice. Look, it's already like you have your label, your tag, your little house. This flower comes with one to attach it. Really nice. There's the pig again. I do like the pig. I got to tell you a funny story real quick. Um, I live right by the water. I don't live on the water, but I'm like a block away. So a lot of the houses around me um, are right on the water. And we were driving around the other day and we, you know, our same way home that we take every day. And my husband like gets this really strange look on his face and he like pulls the car around. I'm like, where are we going? We're like two blocks from home. And he goes and turns around and then we go back. Well, there was a house right on the water and there were two pigs in the backyard, two big pigs. And they were, had like, um, it was like rock, a rock yard. They had rocks, not grass. And there, I swear to God, there were two big pigs. And since then, that was about a week and a half ago, I look for those pigs every time I drive by and I have not seen them again. So I don't know if they own those pigs and if they do they obviously live in the house with them because there's no pen there's no nothing in the backyard or they were pig sitting so i'm not sure i really want to go knock on their door and be like what's the deal with the pigs but how awesome is that to see pigs living in like a you know on the water funny right um okay so now we have this page here this is the chipboard element and it looks like we get quite a few. Look, we get two sheets of those. These I love. I love. And I think I'm getting a little bit better with my layering and embellishing and, and all that. So this is going to be a really fun project. Oh, we got a cow here. Still no chicken, though. I like the cow. Moo. The best day. I don't know if I'm showing you more of these houses. I love that. What's that? Is that an artichoke? Huh. I guess you can somehow work an artichoke into there. There's a bunny. All right. So we have those. And then what else? We, you guys, you have got to see this room behind me. It is just like full of, I've been doing um, those SVG guns and there is just paper everywhere. All right. Then we have these enamel dots. These are really nice. It's like um, shades of green, a gray, a black. Those will coordinate really nice with the set. And then we got this ephemera pack. So let's see what this is all about. So we get 62 die cuts in here. Oh, that's a lot, huh? All right, so we'll just kind of go through these real quick. Um, oh, we have some letters. Those are really nice, right? Letters, a bird. Um more letters, 
to some um, word tags, like little labels, or these little houses, market, love that, homemade, sweet and simple, some blank tags, <clears throat> our nest, oh, and these will be really cute to like layer behind each other, like that kind of, right? And then what's this? We have a picture of, ooh, I don't know what that is. Is that buffalo? All right. That's a little different than everything else that's in here, but we'll take it. Um, some more tags. Another pig. Oh, look at the old, like, percolator coffee pot looking pot. We got our bunny. We got, these look like some journaling cards with a windmill and a silo. Those are really cool. Um, alphabetic, oh, Morse code. That's neat. I don't know Morse code. And then here we have like a frame, a frame piece. Here's the United States in a journaling card. And then we have some flowers. Oh, this one's nice. Gather. Oh, there's my chicken. <laughs> On top of the cow. That's cute. Friends. Um, here's another like round, uh, frame like a wreath and we have another windmill a big bow some flowers and then some little circle numbers so it tells you where did I put that page okay yeah so it tells you on the back everything that you get all right so we'll put that over there and we'll put those away in a little bit and see what else we got take a sip of coffee first guys how long is this video all right I'm gonna wrap it up soon Okay, so here we got the 24 double-sided journaling cards. Let's take these out. And again, everything coordinates with the letters. These are really nice. Home sweet home. I would love to put that in just like a little tiny frame. You just hang that somewhere. Um, everything is double-sided. I love you like biscuits and gravy. <laughs> really cute. They're all really cute. Here's my cards. Here's the alphabet. Here's another letter. Henderson Smokers Original Barbecues. Another fl more floral. Um, this perfect house inspired by J.R.R. Tolkien. Now, wasn't he, it says, this house is a perfect house, whether you like food or sleep, storytelling or singing, or just sitting and thinking best, <clears throat> or a pleasant mixture of them all. Merely to be here is a cure for weariness, fear, and sadness. Isn't J.R.R. Tolkien like the um, Lord of the Rings author? Or Harry Potter? <laughs> I don't know. I know I know that name. Just seems weird to be in here. And this one says smile, quality street coffee house. Oh, there's our artichoke again. We're going to have to find something to do with artichokes. This one's pretty nice. I like these old like sign looking, looking ones. Together is our favorite place to be. Family. Some more florals and like a wreath. Okay, that's that. Two more, two more things, guys. Um, this I'm not going to take out. This is, oh, actually... Oh, so I got this twice because this came in the package of um, this came in, in with the paper pack and then I have a separate one too. So we have two of those. Although this one looks, let me just see something real fast. Yeah, this one's glossy <clears throat> that came separate and the one that came in the paper pack is, has more of a matte finish. So that's pretty neat. All right. And then last but not least, um, I did get the washi tape that went with it as well. I haven't bought new washi tape in forever. So you get four different washies, 10 feet per roll. So I guess that's pretty good. So these will all coordinate. We have a nice plaid. And this one with the little flower twig, twig kind of focusing it's probably all blurry and then this one with the larger plaid and then this pretty floral that goes with all the different florals that um were in there 
So guys, I hope you liked this haul. Um, if nothing else, if you've seen this, if you've seen this set, it gives you an idea of um, just what's in it, how much you get. I think you get quite a bit and that's that. So I can't wait to create some really cool projects to show you guys. And um, I think tonight I have to work on my Mother's Day cards because I haven't done anything for that yet. So, all right, guys, have a great day and I will see you soon.